is, you haven't been the most cooperative people I've ever met, so I don't have much energy to spare, I'm afraid. Here's the deal. I'm thinking of making one more big change in history. Something awesome! You in? That's no excuse! This is a fool's errand! We just got turned back to normal! Hey, you shouldn't let such a dangerous foe out of your sights! We have to stop him at all costs! You guys were on my side. I really don't like to get rough, but you're forcing my hand.
old man. Let him go. He's not good or bad yet, he's just a kid. And I'd venture to say a curious one at that. Curious or not, while he may not be evil, he ain't aligned with good either. Okay, but let's not forget who stopped Deborah and saved me. Might I suggest we all let Fuse escape slide and call it even? Very well. If that's your word as Supreme Kai of Time, then I haven't a choice. I concede. But let it be known. If Fuse so much as thinks an evil thought, our Time Patroller will punish him severely. Understood? How about that? Not only have we managed to fend off Deborah, but his history-altering crew to boot. You have our eternal thanks. Everything you've done is appreciated. That was an intense battle. Even with one notably loose end out there, everything will work out. I'm sure of it. After all... Supreme Guy of Time! All in this together. That Tabura. Talk about a real piece of work. He was. He grew his power just to get revenge on us for defeating Toa. I can't believe he got as far as he did, using the rifts. He even had enough power to turn everyone in Kanton City to stone. And to think, if not for you, he probably would have gained control of our world's history. Woo! Talk about a close call! Things are finally looking as they rightly should. Last, there's one last job to be done. You mean few, right? No, Trunks! You? How could you forget Toki Toki? Where could he have gone this time? <laughs> you... You don't think Dauber took him somewhere? Hard to say with certainty. We were playing hide-and-seek when Deborah attacked. Then he was gone. It all happened so suddenly. One minute I was in the middle of searching for him, and then nothing. Toki-Toki didn't make so much as a squeak. I don't know. Maybe he's been hiding in the Time Nest this entire time and Deborah never noticed. <laughs> Alright then, let's go find him. Why don't we all try calling for him? Toki-Toki! Over here! Toki-Toki! Talk about stupid. 